Okay, guys, listen up, please. Listen up. Uh, now, these two games today, they're massive. It's basically our entire season. They are going to determine whether we take this promotion battle down to the wire or whether we fade away into mid-table, resulting in me getting sacked, which obviously none of us want. So let's get out there and let's make Mubama's final two games memorable. Hey guys, I'm Aussie Villain and welcome back to Grindavik on the Impossible Dream. It is episode 8 today and it is massive, massive things happening because we are facing HK and Kaflek in IBK in the league. Uh, this first one is actually a, a derby for us as well. We are three points behind them with a game more played. We have to we have to take at least four points from this episode. Otherwise, it just starts to get very difficult with a uh, what is it a 22 game season. So after today's episode, there'll be five games left. We can't afford to be too many points back. We really do need to get the results here. Now, there's one game to catch you up on since last episode. But before that, we have had a departure. And that is Dimitrovsky. He has left the club. He's gone back to Macedonia. Uh, now, he was, of course, vice-captain. We have replaced him with uh, Litson, so that's absolutely fine. Um, he did well for us. You know, he's just... He's just was on a little bit too much money. He's doubled his wage, so he's having a lovely old time. And, yeah, it just it's just a little slow. We just have... We had too much slow defenders. And, uh, well, I've actually signed to someone that's just as slow. But, anyway... We saw that last episode. There we go. So that's Dimitrovsky left. Let's catch you up on the game that we've played. That was against... I forget who it was. I can't say it anyway. We went in front when Mubamba found Moa at the back post. Before Mubamba made it 2-0. Quadringa, I think is how you would pronounce that. But anyway, we... Uh... We weren't perfect at the back, even though we did keep a clean sheet, but it was the same old story for us, dominating possession, 62%, and yeah, not really getting the goals we perhaps deserved in this one. Now, Moa actually left the game with a bit of an injury. He is a doubt for today's one, but let's go and have a look at what we're doing here in the first game against IBK Keflak. It is a derby, as I say, a local derby. We're expecting a 4-3-3 from them. And from us, we are getting a 4-3-3. Zivkovic in goal. I've actually uh, I've spoken to him again. I've fined him for one of these performances. I think it was the game, this one here, the 5.8. Uh, so that, let's hope he's he's better. Uh, we've got uh, Binaku. We've got Gunnarsson, Antonitsson, and Runatsson as the back four. We've got all uh, Icelandic centre-backs. The reason for that is Zuba Aziba sorry, is uh, suspended for this one. So... Yeah, we've got uh, an all new look to partnership at the back there. Sayas, Maya, uh, and uh, Maya, 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 and uh, Litson in midfield. Oskarsson and Ndongala as an inverted winger in place of uh, of Moa. Mubamba goes up top. These are his final two games with us. We just need to... Uh, he's not really fit. Uh, he would be on the bench. He's not... We've just got to... We, please, we've just got to score. We need to win these games. All right, so we can see the team sheets there. Uh, I think we beat them when we played them last time. I want to say it was 3-1. Uh, pick off where we left off last time. I'll go with that. Uh, yeah, so let's hope we can put in a performance. But as we've seen many, many times, playing away from home in this league is really difficult. So, and a derby as well. Maybe that maybe that helps us a little bit. That sort of takes some of the home ground advantage out of it. But yeah, I just feel like we really do need to, to get, try and get the six points here. A minimum of four uh, send Mubama on his way back to West Ham and and then just try and, and do enough. I mean, we do create enough chances that it should... Goal scoring shouldn't be a problem for us. I would be more concerned if Mubamba, someone of his quality, was playing at the back for us and then trying to trying to fix that hole. Whereas I feel like J Johnson, Johansson, sorry, Ken, or Johnson, I should say, he can score goals. We've seen Moa, we've seen Endongala chipping in. So... Yeah, I think defensively is much more of a concern. Uh, to the point where training now, I've just I've completely stopped training. At anything that to do with attacking, we are just all about defensive, defensive shape, defensive uh, positioning, all those sorts of things. Mubamba makes a nice run. Mubamba back post there for Endongala. Oh, it's a penalty, is it? Yes, it is. Finally, we've seen a penalty given in this league, and Litson with a chance to give us the lead from the spot. The new vice captain. Come on, mate. Oh, he tucks it away, and he's given us the lead in the derby against the team currently where we want to be in second. And let's hope we can defend in this game. We've not defended well all season. Tell you what, he did me with the eyes there. I was looking this way for it. Very nice penalty. 
Let's praise them. And we've got another highlight here. We're nuts and over a free kick. And let's see what we can do here. Oh, we'll say yes, has lost out in midfield. Can we get back? Gunnarsson is one of our quicker players. We've got to get balls in the middle. There we go. Well done. That actually looked like uh, looked like we knew what we were doing defensively there, didn't it? Which is unlike us. See if Kovic lumps it forward. Not really to anybody. It comes back. And again, we go forward. It's like watching a game of rugby. They're playing for, for territory, not possession. Oh, Renatsen with a crunching tackle. What can... Oh, he just sort of stops. Well, that was silly, wasn't it? This is becoming a very long old highlight. And what is going to become of this? Can we win the ball back? Not as of yet. Eggson goes over. Can he get a tackle in here? Can he stop the cross? He can't end. Well, our lead didn't last very long, as it doesn't tend to do anyway. The new man, Ayrtonson at the back, not able to get his head to the ball cleanly. And about four minutes after we went in front, we find ourselves pegged back. Oh, Zivkovic almost got there too, didn't he? Well, that's uh, that's annoying. All right, let's encourage them. Um, yeah. So still we sit fifth in the league. I did ask for a new contract just to try and <laughs> to tie myself down. Uh, they said because of the uh, of the financial situation of the club that no one's getting offered a new contract until they have to be. So that, that makes for a nervy end to the season, doesn't it? We're not actually going to know if we're going to have a new contract until right at the very end. All right, let's go with not happy there. Let's uh, complacent, exit. Come on, man. He's still looking complacent. Well, that's not fantastic. Uh, let's point finger. No, let's where's fist pump. We've got faith. We've got faith. We've got faith. Yeah, exit. It's just a little bit, a little bit frustrating at times. I mean, he seems to get the job done more often than not. But yeah, he's not. He's not always the most. I think professional is probably the word for it. And he does win that ball back for us there, though. And and Dongala can't keep possession. Zivkovic is there. And let's see what we can do here. Now, I haven't actually looked at the possession stat to see if we're dominating that again or not. Can Maya get there? Oh, we can't. And we've been caught out of the back. And it is across the face of goal. Uh, so we are, but not as much as usual. We've, we've had more possession. I wouldn't say we're dominating it. Um, we'll encourage them. And let's see if we can go and take a lead here. Antonsen is only playing a 6-2, which isn't great. Oskarsson has been caught in possession, which isn't great. And they can't score, which is good. Who's on the bench? Slemdal. All right, we'll bring him on. Uh, Slemdal is, if anything, maybe a little bit quicker. Let's try to demand more. A point here, you know what? It's not the worst result for us. If that's what it's to be. Uh, we've got a corner to defend. Please don't do this to me. It's a way. And Dongala tried to get the ball there. Couldn't get it. And Zivkovic taps it over. Come on, boys. Come on. We need to we need to stand tough here. And that is a way. Here we go. And Dongala. Can he get a little bit of a run going here down the side? He goes. Oh, Oscarson's offside. Uh, it hasn't been. Oh, maybe it has been given. So, you know what? A point on the road, that against second in the league, is not a bad point. I'll take that. The penalty does kind of skew the XG there a little bit. It's a shame we couldn't have held on to the lead for long, but yeah, that's okay. I'm, I'll accept that. So, it leaves us still three points back, uh, albeit having played a game more, but away from home, it's not terrible. Now we need to go play HK at home and make sure we do win that one. So we hold on to draw a uh, conversation about officiating standards. I thought it was a penalty, mate. That's fine. And, uh, well, wait right there. We will be back for Mubama's final game. Okay, welcome back. We are about to host HK, who currently sit third in the table. Three points ahead of us, but they have played a game less. And it is, of course, as I say, Mubama's final game for us. Uh, we're expecting a 4-2-3-1 out of them. And this is the team that we are sending out. Sivkovic in goal, Binaku, Zeba, Antonsen, and Renatsen. Obviously, we need Antonsen to play better this time. Uh, Sayas, Maya, and Litson. In... I'm tempted to play uh, Trevet, actually, in place of Litson for this one, maybe. 
Yeah, let's maybe start Trevitt. Uh, and then it's going to be Endongala and Moa back from injury with, for the final time, Mubama starting up top. All right, so we can see the team sheets there. I don't recognize too many names in their lineup, but like I've been saying, it's, it's first season. We're going to have to learn players as we go here. Let's go out there and enjoy ourselves today. All right, I was gonna, I'm thinking if I could say something to Exxon to try and get him into the game a little bit, but uh, he wants to start complacent, then I guess that's what he's going to do. Yeah, so Mubama leaving is obviously a massive loss. The plan is Jonsson will take over as the striker, and we'll just have to kind of see how it goes from there. I'm hoping Andongala and Moa will could just continue to, you know, be threats down the wings. Whether we might need to to maybe be a little bit more aggressive in our formation and have a number 10 instead of a defensive midfielder, I don't know. Um, I mean, Jonsson, it's not like he didn't score. It was just that uh, Mubama was scoring so many goals, and we've got a free kick here, which never bodes well. Come on, Zivkovic, on your toes. Mate, oh, it's a good free kick. And we're 1-0 down at home in a game we really do need to win. We are running out of time in terms of games, and we really couldn't afford that sort of genius to go in against us. Still plenty of time, though, so no need to panic too much just yet. Let's, uh, let's try and demand more. Let's try getting the ball down the wings. Let's be more expressive. And let's see what we get here. Zebra over a free kick. Looking for Endongala. It's not really anywhere near him. Antonsen can't win the header. Sayas gets back. And let's see where this highlight goes from here. Cross to Zebra. Oh, Jesus Christ. See, and this is the problem. We've been doing so much work on defensive stuff that now we can't play out from the back. I mean, Maya just, just caught ball watching. And at 2-0 down, this, this, becomes, this becomes problematic. I mean, what do we actually do if I get sacked here or we don't get our contract renewed? That that's the big question, isn't it? Um, yeah. Well, we'll cross that bridge if we happen to come to it. Zebra, can we get a goal back before half time? I mean, at two one, it looks a little bit better, doesn't it? And end on Gala picks up a bit of a loose header. It's Trevitt. It's Trevitt. It's Trevitt. <laughs> Ryan Trevitt comes in justifies his selection and pulls us back to within a goal very nicely done and Dongola deserves a lot of credit for this uh, but Trevor the defense opened up for him and he took his chance very very well indeed all right that makes me feel a little bit better we are still behind in a game that ideally we need to win and we're not at half time yet can we win that we can it's Mubama. He's there. He's picked it up. Moha. Back to Mubama. And the goalkeeper makes the save. Moha again from the corner this time. Can he find a Grindavik head? We don't score many from corners. Sayas back out there to Moha. Moha takes on his man to Trevitt, who has a go. Now is it deflected? It was. Another corner. Good pressure late in the first half. Can we make this count, though? It's probably the last action here. Near post, headed away, and that'll be that. Half time, we are 2-1 down. But we haven't been terrible. Show me something else, second half. And, yeah, everybody's looking how they should look, so that's that's fine. And uh, we've got a very motivated Mubama. We need you to have a big, inspired final half as a Grindavik player, mate. Let's encourage. Zivkovic gets it wide. Renatsen keeps it in. Forward for Ndongala. Trevitt to Mubama. Mubama. Mubama! Oh, he's hit the crossbar. Well, that would have been a way to sign off, wouldn't it? Renatsen now with a throw. Ball down. He's looking for Mubama. Can't quite get him. Long ball forward. Zebra will pick it up. Cross for Antonsen. Maya, nice run there by Runatsen for Mubama! Oh, he's hit the crossbar again! Oh, it's a goal! I thought that was going to go back into it. 
like, oh, calm down, calm down. I'm worried about my job, damn it. 14 shots. We're doing okay here. We just need to stop hitting woodwork. Um, here we go. Endongala with a free kick. They scored a belter in the first half. Can Endongala match that for us? Oh, ho, ho, he can! Dano Endongala makes it 2-2 two -two in the 70th minute. And that is every bit as good, if not better, than their free kick in the first half. Massive, massive, massive goal. And can we now go on and claim these three points, which we desperately, desperately need? Next goal in this game is season-defining. Ball forward. Oh, it's been picked up there. We're nuts and can't quite win it back for us. Can Exxon stop a cross coming in? Come on, mate. Please. Please. Cross back. Oh. And it is 3-2 to HK. We've got to do it all again. Runatsen just, just beaten in the air, wasn't he? Let's demand more. Come on. Can Endongala do it again? Come on, mate. We need this as well. We desperately need you to come on. Drag us forward here. Oh, Another stunning free kick, and it is 3-3. Uh, Binaku is looking tired. Uh, don't really have anybody to play left back, mate, so you're just going to have to suck that one up. Uh, Sayas is looking a little tired as well. What we could do for that, I really am a little bit in a situation of I'm not sure if we should stick or twist here, but... We can move those guys around, and that is fine. And we might even put Maya as a ball winner on support. Is there to be a winning goal? He can't score from there, can he? No, he goes looking for Moha. And that actually has worked out extremely poorly for us. And what we don't need... What we don't need... Oh, we don't need this. Zivkovic, save us, mate. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is wrong with our defence? from an attacking free kick. And that might be our promotion chances done. And like I say, I, I don't know what this means for, for the series longer term. Will the board offer me a new contract if we are sitting sort of fifth, sixth region of the table? Moha. Oh, it's not done yet! What's his name? In stoppage time, makes it 4-4. Zivkovic is playing a 5.9 again. Mate, you are pissing me right off. Moha, though, he has been brilliant this season. Gets the cross in. Mubama with the finish. And can he now send us with all three points? I'm almost tempted just to take the point, to be honest. Well, we've got two points out of this. 4-4. We've dominated XG, the goalkeeper's had a stink up, and I mean, it's sort of, it's our season in a game, isn't it? I just wish we could sort out this defence, because we are amazing going forward. Um, yeah, but now we've got to do it without Mubama. So there are the other results. We find ourselves now five points back of second. Um, only, uh, what's that, only six points off top, but with five games to play, it is starting to get to the, what's it called the squeaky bum time isn't it so realistically we're not going to finish any worse than sick although i mean you'd be surprised if they all were able to overtake us i think we're sort of looking fifth and up but we're gonna have to win what four of our last five games if we're gonna if we're gonna get promoted and of course the issue there is is not winning a home game that that is kind of what hurts and don gala that was possibly the performance of the series so far and uh well that will do it for today if you've enjoyed that it was tense um yeah two draws 10 goals and uh yeah there we go so we do have three of our last five games are at home 
which is good. And I think what we'll do is we'll come back for we'll come back for these two games here. I'll play two. We'll come back for these two. Uh, so it will be last chance to nominate your viewers player of the year, and uh, we'll have to vote on that next episode. And then uh, of course we will finish the season at home to league leaders currently. And could we be in a position where we win that and, well, if not get promoted, maybe even win the league? Oh, it's tense. It is just so tense. Take care.